So today at Paradise Meadows, I'm starting a new project and my wife doesn't know it yet, but in a few days, we're having a wood burning hot tub that's gonna be delivered over here. And we're gonna place it at the bottom of this big old oak tree. So I need to get rid of some uh, branches that are dead overhanging up there, level out of space and get it ready. I've got the base ready. It needs to be about four feet by five and a bit, nearly six feet. And I decided to get some rocks up here, which I had to heave up, which are quite heavy, but they're great uh, to keep the sand up. And people will get in from the other side. They'll be sitting over here, looking back towards the farmhouse and the other trees. And I think the chimney will go at the other end over there so that it stays away from the trees. So that's my current plan. And uh, it's good to have this ready to go, roughly level, and then we'll sort it out tomorrow. I have a few more limbs to, or on Thursday, I have a few more limbs to take down from the tree that are dying, but none of them are gonna come on top of the hot tub. So I think it's all pretty good. Here comes our coal coal, which is exciting. Which is great. Very excited to see you. Dirk! Hartelijk welkom! <laughs> this looks good. I like it. You can even go around this tree if you like, if you can make it. Good. And it became double and it was a cheap. Dirk Haynes from Cold Coal. Cold Coal is an amazing South African invention, a wood-fired hot tub, and we've seen them on the farms in South Africa. We're excited to get one. And Dirk, I think I was your first customer, not the first delivered, but the first <laughs> desired. Is that right? First, first person reaching out to me saying, hey, I hear you're bringing it out to America. So yeah, they started exporting it to New Zealand, the UK, Europe. Um, 
Namibia. So I said I want to be the guy selling cocos in America. And so yeah, Brett was the first guy reaching out saying, when is it going to be here? And <laughs> here it is. Fantastic. Well, we're very excited about this. Thank you so much, Dirk. This is going to be an amazing addition to the property. The hot tub is in place. Now I need to just put some river rock around here to make sure this doesn't wash away the sand. So I'm going to do that right now and uh, settle it in so that it nestles in nicely. And I've got a combination of big egg rock and river rock and the two should go pretty well. So we're pretty much done now, putting the little rocks around there just to keep the sand from going away, keep it compacted. I'll attach a pipe over there when I got a better connection. That's the outlet pipe. And then over here, got the small stones to keep the sand compressed. I think it's looking good. It's busy filling up. It's been going for about 20 minutes so far. We'll see how it does. And Looking forward to firing it up this evening. Having looked at it, I'm going to put a few more bags just at the front over here, wrap around there and complete the job. So that's what I'll do. So that looks pretty good, I think, with the rocks out there little piece of wood that's come down from this tree. Now we'll let it fill up and my next job is to get a wood stack over here so we can fire this thing up tonight. So my next job is to make a place to hang the gowns and towels. So I'm going to grab a piece of wood here, off cut of oak, slim it down, attach it to a piece of pressure treated lumber which I'll attach to the tree take it from there but these pieces of wood aren't that great so I'm gonna just hack them apart a bit. Eighty percent of the screws from Ace Hardware broke off, just sheared at the top, so I had to come up with my own concoctions. And there's the rack that my wife wanted for hanging 
uh, gowns and towels. So there we go. So now we're in business. So the fun begins and I'm going to go ahead and start building a fire over here. It's uh, time to give this thing its maiden fire voyage. Oops, there's a furry worm in there that's going to get itself cooked. If I don't get it out, what are we going to do? So here we go, ready to go, see how this works. So I'm adding some pine cones to the mix to get it going quickly. And we'll keep adding wood. So as the unit heats up, it's starting to push hot water out of here into the tub. And uh, you can hear the expansion of the chimney. And uh, that should keep going for about an hour and a half. And then we'll be good to go. before but I bet you've never been in a wood burning hot tub out in a forest. This beautiful cold cold hot tub that we imported from South Africa you fill it with water and then you light a fire so you almost feel as if you're camping because you smell the wonderful smoke and then you hang up your robes and sit underneath this gorgeous ginormous oak tree here in the woods of Paradise Meadows. It's such a treat. Come and see and relax here at our beautiful property. And for the wood pile, we have an Instagram hack, which is a cement block, a couple of pieces of wood stuck in it, just at an angle. And then the dry wood over there, 